All right, hey, what's up YouTube? This is The Cheat, and this is my first build video. I'm doing the Expert Grenadier. And first off, let's start with the most important part of the build, the uh, head and skin. Right here we have the Sandblaster, and uh, yeah, the Sandblaster head, and then the uh, Torg Speed Demon skin. So, there you go. You can't really run Grenadier without these. You just don't, it's not the same. So. It's really important, and something else that's really important is the first skill on your tree. You, you're going to want to pick up Saber Turret with your first skill point, because you can't get any other skills if you don't. So pick that one up for sure. And I'm going to be running down Gunpowder and get to the Nuke, because in my opinion, it's not a true Explosions build without a Nuke. So first off, you can uh, pick between Expertise or Impact. Impact gives gun damage, expertise, swap speed, and other stuff. I like impact. I think it's more helpful overall. And then overload increases assault rifle magazine size, but I'm going to be using things that aren't assault rifles, so I'm going to go metal storm. And then steady boosts grenade damage, which also boosts the damage of Torg weapons, and that's mainly what we're going to be using. So get that. Uh, Battlefront and increases gun damage and grenade damage, which is doubly helpful to Torg weapons, which again is what we're going to mainly be using. And so, pick up longbow turret for longbow nukes, and then do or die is useful when you, like, to get second wins with the meteor shower grenade. And then we have three left, and duty calls doesn't help us because explosive weapons don't get anything. Overload, I already talked about that. Expertise is useful, and rangers... That's alright, I don't really think the buffs are that noticeable. I'm going to go with Expertise, and then those last three points will get me to Nuke. And then I'm going to move over into this tree, the Gorilla Tree, pick up some more damage if you want to. Can go over into Survival, but, you know, I don't know, I like the extra damage. So, yeah, since we have Battlefront, I'm going to be picking up Sentry to increase the time that that's out. And then I'll show you guys later, I'm using a uh, Nova shield. So I'll be picking up Willing to get the Nova back up as fast as possible. And then pick up Scorched Earth and 5 of 5 Onslaught, because movement speed is awesome and so is gun damage. And then Scorched Earth and Nuke, just for a note, are not boosted by explosive damage or, uh, like, they're not boosted by grenade damage or explosive damage relics. So there's that. And then go over and we don't have any health region right now we could pick up able but I'm not really a huge fan of that skill it's a main source of region so I'm gonna be picking up preparation it's not too much but it's shield capacity and then it will help you regenerate a little bit uh, and then the gear let me re-equip all this stuff first off ravager lots of damage you can get it with two extra pellets times 18 instead of 16 but it has a lot less accuracy, and I feel like the accuracy is pretty important. So, yeah. Um, no, that's a hail. I actually just got that. I hadn't finished that yet. And right here we're going to have the plump rifle. It's got a pretty large magazine, pretty good fire rate. It's good. You can get them with higher damage and higher fire rate. This one has the plus magazine size accessory, which is really useful because without it, it's got a 16 magazine. And 26, with the way you damage with this... I mean, 10 extra bullets is pretty much two kills, unless you're fighting a badass or something. So that's useful. And then we have the hard injector. Uh, yeah, innuendo. Fun. Blowjobs. Okay, so yeah. I don't know. It's kind of... their AR and this are about the same. They, this one does a little less DPS, but it reloads a lot faster. But as lower might I don't know. Just use what you want. And then this is my off, just in case I run into something that is not, uh, that's resistant to explosive. So, and overall it's just a good gun, so I, sometimes I pull it out just to do other things. And we're not using the B, we're going to be using the Deadly Bloom. And it's an explosive Nova Shield, and the reason should be obvious, because of explosions. Uh, sticky Homing Meteor Shower. So this is... Good synergy with do or die. If you throw this and fight for your life, there's like a 99% chance of you getting a second wind unless you have a really short bleed out time. And then we're going to be going explosive damage because explosions. 
So, oh yeah, um, no badass ranks. I just moved to PC from Xbox, and my badass didn't get reset. They just didn't transfer over. And I've been building it up, but I haven't spent any of the tokens. So, let's get this started. We're going to be an opportunity, being opportunistic, and exploding all of Jack's little minions. This is probably my favorite place, just because you can run up all the buildings like that. And, oh, I missed. Yeah, I've only been playing mouse and keyboard for like two weeks. So, my aiming skills are not the greatest. There you go. There's a Nova shield. And that corrosion's gonna kill me. Great start. Fantastic start. But, that matter. Second one. Alright. That was not a good start, but whatever. We will, we will persist. Oh, there you are. Hi there, Hyperion turret. You're very dead now. Alright, so let's run over here. And there's bad guy. You're dead. You're almost dead. I should just remember that guy, but whatever. And explosion. Ow, didn't recharge all that. There's that. Not a great start. Oh, well. got him. And oh, this is another good thing about the nuke. I do not like your shield. It's gone. Oh, no, I'm dead again. Doesn't matter. So yeah, you go down. This is not a very tanky build. You will be going down, unless you play carefully. I don't, because I don't like playing carefully, because that's boring. But yeah, unless you play very carefully, you're probably going to be going down a pretty good amount. There we go. Got you. Got you. Got you. You too. Yeah, you can just kind of aim at their feet with the Ravager and carpet bomb them. Like that. And that. Both of them are dead. They're not going to get much deader than they were right there. I'll tell you that. Oh, there's the constructor, so let's check some nades. Generally, I save the nades for uh, five for your life, but against larger targets, let's stay away from there first. You gotta be aware of killing yourself with the meteor shower. Hey, right, come on, constructor, why are you not shooting the constructor? Alright, that was it, back to work. That guy's dead. Get that. All right, so did that. Um, oh, something's building up there. Let's see, I think I can. Yeah, I can run up this wall. Let's run up this wall and see what we got up here. Not. Oh, there you are. You sir are dead. All right. So yeah, running up buildings like a ninja, but I'm not zero. Okay, yeah, more things to kill up here somewhere. There you are. Yeah, let's switch to this. I've taken out these with snipers just because you can easily shoot off their... Uh... Okay, that guy did not want to take any damage from that. What is he doing? Okay, he's being healed. That was difficult. That was, yeah, this gun is just kind of ridiculous. You can use it with whatever and not die. Oh, there we go. Yeah, Fraps is, that's when it splits the files, like every three minutes. So I have a little bit of lag when it splits files. Okay. Let's see, let's kill some more guys. I'm going to kill a couple more guys. I think this is a pretty basic build. You just run around and you shoot stuff. So there's not a whole lot to say about the actual gameplay with it. You just shoot things and they die. Wait for his body to end. Shoot in the face. And yeah, you don't want to be too close to hot loaders because you will die. I've done that more times than I would like to admit. Yeah, there's the guy. Yep. Yeah, the little fleshy enemies just get destroyed by explosives. As you can see. And reloading. And 
Ah, I hate corrosion. It takes so long to wear off. It's like 90% of the reason I use forbearance when I do. It says there's an enemy here, but I don't see it. That was below me. Come on. Oh, great. Failure. Nope, no shield for you. that up there he is poop he's dead let's go see what foreman jasper or foreman rusty or whatever his name is now is up to let's see if we can coax him into black hole shield uh, yeah i should probably reload things whatever those are like the easiest attacks to avoid ever nope thanks for activating my buffs yeah, this guy's more health than I remember him having. I wonder if they like stealth buffed his health like they did for uh Wilhelm or something. There we go. Yeah. The meteor shower is basically just like a fuck everything in that general direction type of attack. So Yeah. You you kill things a lot with it. And I think that'll be about it. You know, you guys get the drone just to build. You yeah. Alright, I'm out.